So this was a little easier than I thought. I um, tried this rigid air compressor with my old style string and handle and it, it fired right off. I had been looking at this um, Predator which is the Harbor Freight manufactured engine and it looks like it's a complete copycat of this Honda that I'm working on. I believe this Rigid is equipped with a Honda originally. Too bad the Predator didn't have the uh, recoil. I could have switched it off. I will be able to use the um, air cleaner cover here from the Predator I think on the on the Rigid unit. This is a Honda, I believe. I couldn't find any markings. It does have a product code on the side. I could try to research that, but I do believe it is a Honda engine on this rigid. So I didn't even have to use any happy juice. I just put the switch to the on position, gave it a tug, and it fired off. Let's see what it'll do. It is on the on position. Let's see what will happen. Oh, nothing that time around. Let's give it another tug. The fuel is on and I didn't have to choke it. So it fired right off. Now I'll go ahead and look for a used recoil for it. So it did seem to build up pressure. Looks like it built up 40 pounds just in that brief minute or two. So maybe I'll continue on with this one, get a recoil and maybe just take the bowl off of the carburetor and, and check that out. I'm sure it could use some attention. I'll degrease it. So there you go. That was an easy one. No happy juice required today. I hope the other projects go as well. I'm going to start this Boland's lawn mower right now, start that project, take the carb off and start cleaning that one. Okay, we're off to a good start. Thanks. Thanks for watching Tommy Kind.